Hey, welcome back to Cottage Tech. Um, beautiful spring day, out watching the birds. I think it's time for another cottage creation. This time I think we should do a kitchen gadget. We're going to do something that most people probably have in their kitchen, but uh, we're going to do it cottage tech style. So uh, let's go see what we can come up with, okay? Mm. Okay, so let's talk kitchen gadgets. Um, very common kitchen gadget up at the cottage, of course, is a good old trusty pepper mill. No big deal. It's a pepper mill. Fill it full of peppercorns. Got a grinder in the bottom. You grind fresh pepper on your steaks, on your food, whatever. No big deal. Um, I think we can do better. Let's get rid of the stock job. See what else we can come up with. Here we have the Cottage Tech pepper mill. This is a little bit different. Before we look at that, though, something else we should talk about. Cordless drills. Are you getting a feeling here? Okay, first off, the cordless drill of choice at the cottage, the Black & Decker Firestorm. We like this drill, I mean, typical sort of standard cordless drill. It's battery powered, if this, this one happens to be a 12 volt, battery powered, variable speed. It's got the, you know, the clutch on it, so you can either drill drive screws or you can, uh, you can drill. Nice thing we like about this is, it has a removable chuck. So, you can put a drill bit in the chuck, and you can put a screwdriver in the uh, quarter inch adapter. So you can now drill a hole and drive a screw. When you go through as many deck screws up here as we do, these things are indispensable. It saves you running extension cords for plug-in drills. It also saves you running two drills and having to pick one up to drill a hole, pick the other one up to drive the screw. You just run this one, you drill a hole, you drive the screw, you drill another hole, you drive the screw. These are indispensable up here. Back to the pepper mill. We've done a slight modification of this pepper mill. I don't know if you know this or not, but let me give you a close up. I've sanded the top of this down flat. Now I've got a little bushing in here to take up the extra space, but the reason is that there's a shaft that comes up through this that connects to the grinder in the bottom. And I need a little extra space on that. Because that's going to come in handy. First off, our peppercorn up at the cottage is the black peppercorn. We prefer that. We could use the telesherry. That's the mix of the green and the red and the black. That's a little bit way too big city for us. We like it rustic. We like it old school up here. So we're going with a good old fashioned, old school, traditional black peppercorn. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to we're going to fill this pepper mill up with some black peppercorns. Uh, let's put lots in because, hey, it's, it's steak night tonight. We're going to put the top back on that. Now, normally right about now, the thing to do would be to uh, put the, uh, the finial, that's a $20 word for putting the screws on the top, and we'd be grinding pepper, and we'd have a traditional pepper mill. I think we can go one better with this one. Let's take that finial off there. Let's take the chuck off the old cordless drill. Yeah, I know. And uh, let's put the chuck on the top of the pepper mill. Now that's the nice thing about the, uh, the removable chuck on the drill is we put the chuck on the top of this and we still got a traditional pepper mill. Nice decor, black and orange, stands out at, in the, at the cottage. It's your traditional pepper mill. And you can use it like that, but you snap it onto the old cordless drill and you've got yourself a pepper grinding machine. Boy, I tell you, when it's past tonight, would you like some fresh ground pepper on that? You're doing good. When my wife shows up, she loves fresh ground pepper. This is right up her alley. She'd love this. And of course, when you get to the really big dinner parties, when all the pepper heads show up, you swap out the old 12 volt cordless for the big 24 volt bad boy and you're grinding pepper like nobody's business. So hey, there you have it boys and girls. 
our latest cottage tech, cottage creation, the cordless pepper mill. Best of all, it works. Thank you.